Ni 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 nah. Kita Now for the tools and materials. First of all, the tools. We're going to use cutter, scissors, a hot glue gun. Don't forget the glue stick, some tips, and also some cable tie. And now for the materials. First, eight syringes, 10 mm syringes, a small wooden stick, and small and large wooden stick some barbecue sticks and also small rubber tube and don't forget your cardboard okay that's all for the tools and materials now let's go for the process of making the oh no project and now let's go for the process of making the robot arm let's go Okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh So right now, I will explain on how this hydraulic arm works So for our project, we use a pair of 4 syringes So this is, you can see, 1, 2, 3 and 4 And for the hydraulic arm, this is the number 1 This is number 2 Number 3 and then number 4 Okay, so the first syringe is connected by the light blue tube which plays a role in rotating the hydraulic arm so if you can see here if I pull the first syringe you can see it rotates whether left or right and then if I push it back it will rotate it will turn right for syringe number 2 it plays a role in adjusting the height of the lower hydraulic arm so if you can see here if I pull change number 2, it becomes lower and then if I push it back, it gets to a higher level and then my friend next will explain on how change number 3 and number 4 works Ok, Assalamualaikum Now I will explain about the shrink number 3 and number 4 So the shrink number 3 is connected to the 
shrink uh, at the upper arm here you can see so when I pull the shrink number 3 you can see that the arm will pull down and when I pull the shrink the arm will move upward so next is the shrink number 4 the shrink number 4 is control the claw and you can see when I pull the shrink number 4 the, the claw will close and when I push the back the shrink you can see the claw is open thank you yeah. <laughs>